us uh, tonight, today, this morning, whatever time of day it is, maybe for you, let us discuss a little bit of meditation. What does meditation mean? What does it, what does it do? How does it quiet our mind? How does it bring clarity to our existence? And really, I think many of you who might be afraid of meditation, might not know what that is, really could bring some awareness to your own life when you realize there may even be times when you're already meditating. Take for me today. I had a beautiful day here in sunny Southern California, Marina Del Rey, and I did some boat work. Did a little chipping, sanding, cleaning up my beautiful uh, passion here in the marina. And in that space, I put on some nice music, did a little oiling, a little teaking, and you begin to see, I began to feel just this kind of oneness, this quietness, this comfort in that space. As my mind began to shut off, I knew what I was doing, I've done it many times before. There's really very little mind that's necessary. And the realization came back to me from so many years ago from a meditation teacher of my own, that it exists at all different times of the day, maybe when you're driving, maybe when you're zoned out, just kind of contemplating. So in that awareness, when maybe you're really focused upon something and really clear upon something, take that breath of life. Take that slow, gentle inhale. We can even do it right here. As you breathe, as it enters, you begin to feel that omnipotence, that room around you, that aura within you just radiates, just comes into one, into all, into ultimately everything. So I encourage you next time somebody says, hey, Let's go do this meditation, or what is that meditation about? Open, open yourself up. Take a second just to quiet your mind. Feel your breath. Feel that pulse of life entering through your body, flowing through every ounce of your being, and open up to it. Open up to the possibilities that are there. It may not be for you, I'm not saying it has to be, but there could be a, a gem, a gift, an awareness waiting inside the quietness of your mind. I tonight was just finishing a little writing segment for a good friend of mine who I was doing some jumping for the other day, and I recall the story many years ago. I was uh, 18 on board this uh, carrier, a uh, pre-positioning military vessel out in the middle of the Mediterranean Ocean. I had all these questions, confusions, misunderstandings of my life, of what everything kind of meant. And I began to sit down in front of a computer just like this and let my fingers do the walking. I would ask myself questions and I could just begin to write, begin to feel. And I opened up a space of spirit, a space of truth, a space that I didn't even know. I was a very young, ignorant, 18-year-old man and open up some, some pretty great awarenesses for my own life that to this day still are profound that I take to every day. And so I encourage you, because for me in this space, I didn't know what I was doing. I knew nothing about writing or channeling or, or being some kind of entity of God. Who, who knew what any of that meant? But all I did know is that there was a calling from within me that said, go sit down in front of the computer and just begin writing, just begin doing what feels necessary. And maybe that might not be exactly for you. Maybe there's some other way that you can express your own creativity, express a way to get in tune with what's coming out from within you. But like I'll continue to say through all these posts, break free that comfort zone, break free that space that's waiting, waiting to come out because when it is, it's so magnificent, it's so beautiful. And I thank you, I thank you for listening, for observing, and being the beautiful soul that you are. Aloha and Namaste.